Those new lawsuits target both the celebrities involved and the universities named. One mother is asking for $500 billion in damages, saying her son was robbed of a top-tier education. This is the biggest names accused of wrongdoing are facing new backlash. This morning, under indictment and out of a job, actress Lori Loughlin dumped by the Hallmark Channel after investigators say she and her husband paid half a million dollars in bribes to get their children into USC. Why'd you go to college? Mostly my parents really wanted me to go. Also dumped Lachlan's daughter, YouTube star Olivia Jade, dropped by beauty sponsors Sephora and Tresemme after becoming the face of the scandal. Multiple media outlets reporting both of Lachlan's children now withdrawing from USC. It's not just celebrities and wealthy parents under fire. A new lawsuit has been filed by a student at Stanford University. Kalia Woods is suing the eight colleges involved and William Singer, the alleged mastermind behind the scheme, saying she never knew the admission system was an unfair rigged process in which parents could buy their way into the university through bribery and dishonest schemes. If they faked information or something like that, then I think, you know, expulsion, um, revoking of a degree, I think that would be warranted. The entire Operation Varsity Blues may have been triggered by a financial executive who was already under investigation. NBC News learning Maury Tobin was seeking leniency in an unrelated securities fraud case and told investigators the women's soccer coach at Yale asked for a bribe to get his daughter into that university. One of the 33 parents arrested, Hollywood star Felicity Huffman, is out on bail after investigators say she paid $15,000 to have a proctor correct her daughter's SAT answers. Her character on Desperate Housewives paying a bribe to get her kids into school. Investigators say life imitating art. A generous donation will ensure our kids beat them out. How generous? 15000 this morning, the real-life suspects may be Hollywood stars, the wealthy and the privileged, but investigators say the victims are the children who lost spots at the universities they deserve to attend. Joe, back to that, back to that lawsuit. How many people could end up being involved? Well, Craig, if the courts agree to certify it as a class action suit, as lawyers are asking, more than one million students could possibly join it. Stanford University says the lawsuit is filed without merit. Investigators say none of the universities played a role in this scheme.